word. First article. Now, what if I told you about this little story? There were two brothers from Thailand, Chang and Eng. Their mum sold them for five hundred dollars, and they ended up touring around the world in a circus. Then, shortly after their circus careers ended, they married two sisters and had twenty-one kids. Would that interest you? That story. Does it sound interesting at all, <laughs> Alexander? I'm looking at uh, you. <laughs> <laughs> you look puzzled. Also, uh, you, you better hope it sounds interesting, <laughs> otherwise, we're no point of a podcast. <laughs> is, it, is that one story? <laughs> yeah, it's one story. <laughs> yeah, one but, but, story. Like those two, the two parts are they related in any way? What two parts? They were sold, like, them being sold into a world touring circus, I feel like, is a story. And them having 21 kids, I feel like, is a completely different... Like, I'm so intrigued to see how this all ties in. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Well, that's true. It, it does sound like it could be a completely different story, doesn't it? Now, I love how you are semi-interested, but would it interest you more to know that Chang and Eng... <laughs> were twins not just any twins in fact they were siamese twins does that interest you where were they joined huh where were they joined they were actually joined at the liver (laughs) or they wouldn't be able to have 21 children then if they were (laughs) <laughs> that would make the story so much more interesting <laughs> they were joined they were. at the liver and only by a thin piece of skin really isn't so i'm i'm not the best at internal organs the anatomy of internal organs but isn't the liver like on the front of you so were they face yes. to face their whole life they were kind of yeah ish slightly. kind of so i mean that's close to being adjoined at the penis then as far what? as trying to have kids. <laughs> like, what? the woman's going to have to slide in between, like, the meat and no, the sandwich. No, like, no, it was more, like, to the side-ish, wasn't it, a little bit? It was to the side. It was a liberty to the side. Let's, uh, I'll keep, keep going with the story. Yeah, like, I'll, uh, bring, bring up a... I'm I'll just going to give... You yeah, I'm just going to give you some more info, really. So, basically, they were Chang and N Bunker. Chang and Eng Bunker. I don't know where the bunker came from. Yep. Um... They were born in a Chinese community in Siam, Thailand. Parents were Chinese. And this was like back in the day. 18. 1811 back in the day. 1811? Yeah. Yeah. That's a long time ago. Very long time ago. So they're just at home in their little village in Siam when this... Scottish guy, Robert Hunter, shows up. He spotted them and was like, hey, mum, do you want to have a little bit of money and I'll take them off your hands type thing. So she sold the twins to him and he took them and he took them on a world tour. They didn't get paid much. He kind of exploited them. So when they got to 21 years of age, because he took them, I think they're about 17 or something. Yeah, very young. When they got to 21, they ventured out on their own. And then after that, they were done with the circus career. They kind of just wanted a quiet life. They settled in North Korea. No, Carolina. <laughs> <laughs> Not <Whoa>. North Korea. <laughs> North Carolina. <laughs> the story. We're behind the iron the story turner. continues. <laughs> <laughs> There's more intrigue now. They ended up in North Korea. <laughs> <laughs> so when they're in North Carolina, they met their wives. Now, these wives were sisters. Um, Kind of a big outcry towards the sisters, like, you're disgusting. What are you doing? Blah, blah, blah. blah. But it's because literally one of them fell in love. And then the other one didn't really like their sister too much. But he's like, oh, fine. 
all right, then I'll, I'll just <laughs> I'll get with a sister because you know my, it just is easier type thing. Were the sisters joined? No, sisters were not twins and not therefore joined. Um, they all shared a single reinforced bed. Sisters started getting a bit cranky at having to always sleep in the same bed, so ended up he and they the twins would end up going from one house to the other, staying there for three days at a time, then going to the other ones together. Now, another interesting fact is they, whilst they were all living in North Carolina, owned a plantation. And they had slaves and stuff. I just thought that was a bit interesting. Anyway, so this was all during the war in 1811. And then after the war ended, they basically almost went broke. Their plantation, plantation almost went broke. One of the twins, Chang started getting depressed and he started drinking himself silly. He, I think they were like riding a horse somewhere, like in a carriage, and he, for example, refused to put clothes on to try and freeze himself. Anyway, long story short, he ended up dying one morning, Morning, like Aang woke up and he, he was like, oh my gosh, Chang's dead. 15 minutes later, Aang died. They don't know why to this day. They don't know why he died. He was the healthy one. Can I just give you a really oh. mind-blowing fact? Oh. Chang and Eng Bunker were the original Siamese twins. That is where Siamese twins was born. From them, because they were born in Siam. <laughs> and they were twins. <laughs> <laughs> this went from intriguing story of the past to myth very quickly at the end there wait what which part well i mean i'm not a scientist but i can guess why the second one died when the first one died the first (laughs) one being the person who joined shared a liver with them like (laughs) Is that not just obvious? <laughs> <laughs> I think I might have ended, uh, might have said, and to this day it's still unknown. <laughs> I think at the time it was just unknown because actually, <laughs> Eng. I'm thinking it was liver failure. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but the thing is, Eng had never considered being not joined with. Chang and Chang until Chang decided to just act a fool and then Eng was living healthily and he was like maybe we should be just not joined because at one point it got so bad that he was basically just dragging Chang around and he had to like manufacture this like whole system of straps and pulleys to help with the weight of Chang Anyway, it wasn't until they um, did die, scientists immediately basically came in and dissected them and and whatnot, and that's when they discovered they were joined actually at the liver. So if they had been separated at birth, they would have both died. All oh, right. Yeah. Mm. So I, I was going to say, I lost interest in the story about when you told me it was really, really old. I was, I thought it was more modern. Right, mm-hmm. and some lady had sold her twins. I was like, "Oh my god, this is like human smuggling and stuff," you know. <laughs> hey man, what? I didn't know this still happens. <laughs> and I was like, I, 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 "Eighteen something? Yeah, I, I see her selling the twins." <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. I am no longer surprised on that topic. This is true. Like, if it was in today's age, I, I'd be quite surprised, but. 18, 11, whenever it happened. Yeah. Yeah. You I can understand probably, yeah. it. Yeah, I can understand she sold them. <laughs> so they had 21 kids, right? Yeah. So when when the idea that they're the original Siamese twins, yeah. I'm guessing by that they just mean the they coin, were the first the... documented. That's where the name came from. Yeah. There was actually... Like, I'm assuming... Like... They're not. They're not suggesting that every Siamese twin since then comes from those twenty-one children, are they? No. 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 <laughs> Sorry. No. 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 There was actually conjoined um, twins before them, but these two became so famous because they were traveling around in a circus. Everyone was like going to see them. They were from Siam. 
they coined that was where the term Siamese twins originated. Like that right. that, that sort of term was coined. They, they, from don't, like them. Be, they don't like to be called Siamese, Siamese twins. twins anymore. No. That, yes, that's true. Yeah. Um, that's true. I've actually got a couple of Siamese twin facts, by the way. <laughs> Did you know how Siamese twins I think- occur? Well, con- <laughs> conjoined twins uh, is a more appropriate term. Develop when an early embryo only partially separates to form two individuals. So, although two fetuses will develop from that one embryo, they basically remain connected, um, and it's usually at the chest, abdomen, or pelvis. And they usually so may also share one or more internal organs. I might get this. I might get this terminology wrong, but I think that means they're always monozygotic. Don't know, because I don't know what that Meaning, means. Meaning, so I, I, this is my now, oh gosh, half my life ago, science education coming back. Mm-hmm. I believe monozygotic, monozy- monozygote and dizygotic, I think it was, where yeah, mono dizygotic. is like the identical and di is the... Not identical. Oh. Is that right? No. Uh, oh. They're separate placentas. Z- Dizzy Gothic is separate placentas. And the uh, identical is the same placenta. Is that right? Is that what you meant? No. Yeah. But, but then, yeah. So the identical is monozygotic, right? Yeah. Mm. Woman, a warning. Yeah. So I'm gonna- that, so because of the way you said that, I'm guessing there's. Uh, conjoined twins are always monozygotic. They're always identical. They're never. Oh. Oh. All right. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. That's right. Um, now, fun facts that I'm going to leave you with. Chang and Eng today still have more than 1,500 descendants that they have created. One of which is the Pulitzer Prize winner, which is the music prize thingy, their great granddaughter will be great, great, whatever granddaughter, Caroline Shaw. And she is an American composer, violinist, and singer. And she's been on a number of Kanye West songs. Ooh. That's crazy. Crazy. There you I go. I still want to know, like, how. How the baby making happens that, in that situation. <laughs> you want to know yeah. how, how how they did sexy time? Yes. Me too. So so my my mate sent this um, article in. Oh Rob, yeah, thanks, Rob. Rob sent this in, and he specifically told me to ask you guys how do you think they were making the babies. That's the <laughs> most. That's the part that he wanted us to discuss most of all. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, I would have put a sheet over my brother. Why? For it, right? Because I don't want him to see me and the missus, you know, doing the funky town. Yeah. <laughs> I'm guessing that he's seen yeah. you do a lot more throughout I know. your life. I think so. <laughs> he's probably giving you a hand. What? <laughs> probably a hand. 